I'm tatted up, but it's all my fam. You know they want to say that he the man. <laughs> Told you, yep, the other man. They couldn't be better than me the other hand. <laughs> Let me ask you, since you're speaking about your dad, and you do music. Yeah. I find that both of them are kind of the same. Yeah. In the sense of, you you know, the drive, the, yeah. the you you know, maybe this song ain't as good as that yeah. song. You know, yeah. you got the long, you know what I'm saying, yeah. the bomb for the touchdown yeah. or the breakaway. Do you do you agree? Do you find it? It's, I mean, it, you know what I'm saying. It's, it, you know what? Life, I think, is like that. Word. Life is a, is a continuous hustle. Mm -hmm. You you got to be able to stay in your, on your grind because there's always people that are working just as hard as you out there, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's why I tell kids all the time, you know, it's not about... You know, just being good at sports is about going to school, mm -hmm. you know, because getting your grades right. Because you might be good. This other kid in, in Connecticut might be just as good as you, mm -hmm. but his grades are better. He's going to get that scholarship. Yeah. Keep working harder. Mm -hmm. It's all about working hard, working hard. And work for self. Mm -hmm. you no, know, do it for you. You can't do it for anybody else. Mm -hmm. You know, you can make yourself happy. When you look at yourself in the mirror at nighttime or when you listen to those songs that you that you make, are those are that a direct reflection reflection of you, and if it is, then you should be happy. But it's not about anybody else. But so you make the songs uh... for myself. That's what I was the, about no, to no, say. Listen, yeah. I make the songs for myself, uh -huh. but it's for the people. I'll, uh -huh. give, I'll keep giving music for free all day long because mm -hmm. I just want people to listen to what I have to say. But you know, some people get carried away in the booth and trying to talk talk about the life that they're not living. Mm -hmm. You know, it's easy to, for for cats to talk about that they're using guns and shooting somebody. But trying to people know that I don't do that, so it makes me have to use my rhymes and and say some things that are a lot funnier. So that's why I think my rhymes are different because I can't really lie about me. Because you can go pick up a book at the at the bookstore at Barnes and Nobles and you can learn a whole lot about me. Mm -hmm. So there's not a lot that I can hide. So it's just. You know, I try to tell people, be you. Make the music for you, and then the people will love it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm about. Well, where'd you go to school at, Jared? Uh, the U. <laughs> I just had to say that. <laughs> you, I ain't mad at you. I always shout out to you because that's even even then. That's People don't understand. When I was in Miami, uh, was the hardest time music-wise for me. I didn't write anything from my freshman year into my like senior year. And so I, how long you been rhyming? You know, <laughs> yeah. Ever since I got out 2003. Where, where? When I've been really doing it. But I couldn't write anything. I was in this weird slump. Mm -hmm. I just was, couldn't write anything and just had a pen and a paper and then just couldn't write. It happens. It happens. So, but, to the best of us. Yeah, but now I'm, I'm at where I'm at. Mm -hmm. It's every single day, everything that I've seen, every place that I've traveled, every person I've met, I can, you know, put that into a song. So... I've seen a lot.